Saturday morning on the road today. Hey, hey. The sun is blazing on a one. Good morning, Bamfors Kiss here. I am standing in, well actually I'm in the village of Las Lunas. I'm on Highway 6 and what you're looking at here is, they call it the Facebook uh, data center. Okay. And I didn't know a whole lot about it and last night I was going through the channels on my TV and I uh, came across something called uh, Issues and Answers. And there was a House of Representative, I, I don't remember his name, I'll link it below, uh, from Valencia County who was on there talking about the Facebook's uh, data center. And so I'm just going to share with you what I learned last night watching the show. Originally they bought about 378 acres. They ended up buying 400 more acres next to them. Uh, there's going to be six data centers and they're going to be the length of three football fields. I'm pretty sure that's what he said, or three, uh, three football fields. Uh, data center one and two are up and running. They're still working on um, some of the other ones. You can see the crane in the background there. They said construction's going to be done by 2023. And uh, that's pretty much when the jobs are going to dry up because right now that's about all that they're hiring uh, or have hired is uh, construction workers. Another thing that the uh, representative said was that they have twice as many, okay, let this sink in, twice as many security personnel as they do employees. Why would that be? Okay, I realize some of you guys, some of you are going to say, well, it's a data center. Okay, to me, the biggest threat of a data center would be a, fra a faction outside of the data center, like, you know, some foreign country or um, hacking, things like that. Not something that would be inside the data center. So, to me, it seems very suspicious they would have that many employees, uh, um, security employees. Uh, second, you can't get in here easily you've got to go through checkpoints and um, I, you know this angle I'm at here it's not as good as I'd like it because you know it's along the highway here and I don't want to get hit by a car but there's a fence there that it reminds me a lot of the border wall fence that we've seen down there at um, the Arizona border of Mexico and I mean why would a data center I mean I realize there's going to be, if it is a data center, there's going to be, um, you know, secured information there and things like that. And people want their information secured. You know, I just don't, I'm, I'm not buying it. Okay. I just, I didn't buy it from the day that they said they were going to build it. And I still don't buy it today. I don't, I mean, look how far down that goes. It goes all the way down to where you, I don't even know, maybe that building that looks like uh, a half barrel in the ground, kind of like a Quonset hut, is part of it. But you can see the fence. Look how far that fence goes down. There's almost 800 acres here for a data center. I don't know. I just think it's suspicious. You know, anybody that has any information that is, um, you know, something other than, you know, it's good information, you know, something reliable, like what I got from the TV show last night, you know, Comment below. I want to know. I want to know what you think of this. I, I, I don't get a good feeling every time I've got, I drive past this place. I just think it's something else. Oh, another thing that the representative said was that there's no heat. No heat in any of these buildings. Because uh, he claims that they said that uh, the computers are so hot they don't need heat. And, um, which, you know, I believe to be true. But, you know, there could be no heat for other reasons, too. I don't know, but um, I don't think this is a good thing. I mean, by the time this is all said and done and 2023 comes along, um, there's going to be very few people in Las Lunas that are even employed by uh, Facebook. They're going to, because they brought in a lot of their own people to run whatever this is from other areas. And so I, I don't really know what the reason was that they brought this here. 
I mean, he talked about taxes, but I mean, how do you tax a data center? Any ideas on that, David? Yeah, I don't have any ideas on that either. I mean, please, you know, I'm just hungry for information about this. You know, debunk me. Tell me that I am just totally whacked out and I know nothing. You know, that I'm just a paranoid old woman living out in Laguna. <laughs> I'd be thrilled to hear that because let me tell you, I'm a highly suspicious woman living in Laguna. So, yeah, I wish I had a better angle, but I really can't pull off the highway higher up the road um here i'm gonna you're gonna see my truck here in a second Let's see hi jack see look at the fence goes all the way over to there and you see there's not even anything there so you see they they are going to build more and do you see all the power poles back there i mean i realize if it is a supposed data center it does take a lot of electricity to run it but i just i don't know I mean, it, I don't know. Give me your opinion. I want to hear it. Um, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and uh, Angel will be back in the next video. He stayed home today. So until then, remember, always one soul. So if you go out into the woods today, hey, hey, beneath the maple where we used to play, 